I am he bringing help for the sick as they pant on their backs, and for strong upright men I bring yet more needed help. I heard what was said of the universe, heard it and heard of several thousand years. It is middling well as far as it goes, but is that all? Magnifying and applying come I, outbidding at the start the old cautious hucksters. The most they offer for mankind an eternity less than a spirit of my own seminal wet. Taking myself the exact dimensions of Jehovah and laying them away. Lithographing Kronos and Zeus his son and Hercules his grandson. Buying drafts of Osiris and Isis and Belus and Brahma and Adonai. In my portfolio placing Manito loose and Allah on a leaf and the crucifix engraved. With Odin and the hideous faced Mexitli and all idols and images, honestly taking them all for what they are worth, and not a cent more. Admitting they were alive, and did the work of their day, admitting they bore mites as for unfledged birds who have now to rise and fly and sing for themselves. Accepting the rough deific sketches to fill out better in myself, bestowing them freely on each man and woman I see, discovering as much or more in a framer framing a house, putting higher claims for him there with his rolled-up sleeves, driving the mallet and chisel, not objecting to, much to special revelations, considering a curl of smoke or a hair on the back of my hand as curious as any revelation. Those a hold of fire engines and hook and ladder ropes more to me than the gods of the antique wars, minding their voices peal through the crash of destruction, their brawny limbs passing safe over charred laths, their white foreheads whole and unhurt out of the flames. By the mechanic's wife with her babe at her nipple, interceding for every person born. Three scythes at harvest, whizzing in a row from three lusty angels with shirts bagged out at their waists. The snag-toothed hustler with red hair, redeeming sins past and to come, selling all he possesses and traveling on foot to fee lawyers for his brother and sit by him while he is tried for forgery. What was strewn in the amplest strewing the square rod about me, and not filling the square rod then. The bull and the bug never worshipped half enough, dung and dirt more admirable than was dreamed, the supernatural of no account, myself waiting my time to be one of the supremes, the day getting ready for me when I shall do as much good as the best and be as prodigious, guessing when I am it will not tickle me much to receive puffs out of pulpit or print, by my life lumps becoming already a creator, putting myself here and now to the ambushed womb of the shadows.